Good morning YouTube. It is Monday morning. Well, it's about Monday afternoon. Very nearly. We've got Zoom in 10 minutes time. So I'm really, really excited about that. Let's get going. Let's have a really, really good day and let's help some amazing people. So let's just do it. Zoom is finished and it was a great Zoom. Some really, really cool entrepreneurs coming on the call who are starting a journey. Some people have been doing it for a few months struggling. So we're just giving them some advice and helping them along their way. It's great to hear from Tim again. So he was coming on the Zoom for a while. He was really, really struggling to get leads, to get out there and get viewings. We helped him change up what he was doing and change his script. From the back of that, literally a week or two after we told him that, he had three viewings and he secured one of them. So just from coming on our three Zooms, he managed to secure a property and he does this isn't me saying this, this is literally he said it on a call today put it all down to us helping him he wouldn't have had that opportunity if it wasn't for coming on them zooms and helping us so now he's making money every single month on a rent to rent service accommodation and he puts it down to us for helping him completely free of charge on these zooms and that's what it's about we want to help you it's not like we'll sign up to our training we'll help you even more like we'll help you obviously more but if you've got a question on a zoom we're here to help you so whatever it is come on let me help you let us help you be fantastic right now i've got to catch up on quite a bit of work accountancies and all that sort of stuff uh, i reach now because the deadline's due at the end of the month so let's get that sorted like that so he was he was happy with all that so he said his good evening everyone time to go play netball and that is monday night done good morning everybody it is tuesday it's half past ten in the morning and I'm running to the shop really quick. We don't really have anything in. I'm playing golf today, so I need something to eat. So I'm gonna run to the shop now and get some bits. Tomorrow's gonna be a busy day. I'm up early, got my hair cut at half nine. Lighting's gone weird. Hair cut at half nine. I have then got meeting someone at 12, who's interested in the training and mentoring, which is cool. And then at half two, I think I'm gonna go view that HMO, which was postponed from when it was snowing. So that'd be good. Right now, let's get some food. On our way to go golf it up right now. So I'm really excited about that. It's been a while since I played golf. The weather's not been great. Still a bit wet today, but it's not raining. So that's the main thing. So it'd be great to get out there and actually play around the golf. Golf is done. I've got a right quick right now because of the wind. On my way back home. Oh my God, I made it even worse. Getting a haircut tomorrow morning. <laughs> On the way back home, it was a good round. I didn't play too good on the front nine, but then back nine, I really pulled it back. Ended up fin finishing with a gross score of 87. Um, I've got quite a high handicap as well, so net score, I have to go work that out when I get home. Um, Cause I just, I just do gross when I'm playing. If it's a path four, I want to get a four, you know what I'm saying? So I think it's the best way to improve. So I got 87, uh, Ben got 89, I believe he got, which is good because that's the second only time I've got into the 80s. Last time we played last week or the week before, I got 90, he got 89. So he's been consistent, two 89s. But for me to go and get an 86 today was phenomenal. So gonna get back, get some food and do some work. And that is Tuesday finished. We've got a very, very busy day tomorrow. Tomorrow being Wednesday. I'm up early to get my hair cut. We've got a meeting at 12 o'clock with someone who's interested in the training. I've got a viewing at 2.30, we've got a public zoom at 7, so there's quite a lot of back to back to back to back things happening tomorrow. So, looking forward to that. Peace. Good morning everybody, it is Wednesday morning, it's 20 past 9. I've got 10 minutes into my hair appointment. Busy day today, let's go, go, go. Let's go get a haircut. Fresh trim. I'm now going to nip to fresh trim. I am now going to nip to Morrison's and get some eggs. I'm really fancy on one, so let's go do that. Meeting number two. Time to go to it. It's going to be really good to meet Dan, get to know him a bit more, see how we can help him going forward. I'm excited. The meeting went really, really well with Dan. Super excited about helping him. He seems like he's super passionate about this and that he really, really wants to push forward and create something for himself, which is what it's all about. I am now going to be setting off in around 10 minutes to the viewing, which will be super exciting. Can't wait to look at this one. The landlord sounds amazing and it sounds like we can really work together long term and take a few properties on. So let's see what happens at the viewing. The viewing went really well, just speaking to the landlord and seeing how we can benefit them. They're still unsure on what they want to do with it, whether they want to do it themselves or just have it completely passive and hands off. I think they want to do it passive and hands off because she said I work full time and I want no stress, I just kind of want an income from it. 
So I think she's leaning towards us. She just wanted to get a full picture of everything. So that's really, really cool. It was still literally a building site, and I mean a building site. There wasn't a sink, there wasn't a shower, a toilet, nothing. It was just back to brick. Um, no flooring down or anything. So still got a bit of time. The date they've said is the 11th of March, which is funny because that's my birthday. Write it down. But it's probably going to be longer than that. And it always takes longer than that. So bit of a waiting game right now. Be interesting to see what happens. I'll keep you updated. Busy, busy afternoon. So after I came back from the viewing, I chilled out for just a couple little bit. Then I went to my mum's to have some food. And then I was rushing home to get on the Zoom. And then did the Zoom. And then I did some more work. And now it's midnight. And I'm going to go to bed. Good morning, everyone. It is Thursday morning right now. Tonight, we're going to go watch the Giants play, which is really exciting. It feels like it's been forever since we've done that. Right now, we're going to go play golf again. Second time this week. Why not? If you've got the time, do what you enjoy. I've got nothing booked in today. So we're going to go play golf. So I'm really excited about that. Golf, home, chill, Giants. Great day. Absolutely fantastic day. So I'm really excited about this day. Let's go do it. Let's go score a really, really good round. When I played on Tuesday, I scored 87 gross, which net was actually, I think it was 62 net with my handicap, which is crazy. That's 10 below par, which is just absurd. So let's try and do that again. Second time in my life I've ever hit 87. Um, second time in my life I've ever broke eight, 90. So to break it by that much is good. So let's try and do it again today. At least shoot around 90. I'll be happy with that. Consistency is key. I'm excited. Golf is done. I've just come home. Didn't shoot too well. Started off okay, not the best. And I thought I'd put it back on the back nine like I usually do. Um, but I just kept getting six, 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 six. Double bogeys all the time. Finished with 97, which I'm not too disheartened with because I am an amateur golfer. But to go from 87 to 97, it's not good enough. So yeah, but that's golf. Cool. It punishes you when you're down, it doesn't let you up, holds you super accountable. But I started off really well, birded the first hole. So it's like, how can I start like that and then finish like that? But it is what it is, it happens, that's golf. Uh, I'm home now, I'm gonna chill for a little bit, catch up on work, have some food, and then get ready to go to the Giants. Time to go to the Giants. <laughs> and that is it for Thursday. Unfortunately, the Giants could not get the win. It sucks. But it is what it is. We've got another game on Saturday. Hopefully we do something special there. But right now, it's half one in the morning. I'm gonna go to bed. Good morning everyone. It is Friday morning. We have just been at a bakery. Parks Bakery. Parks Bakery in Oldham. And we're not at Costco, we're in a queue to use the fueling services. It's a big queue. So we're kind of waiting for this, then we need to go into Costco. Fun. <laughs> it's been a long day. Just come home, it's now 5 to 8 in the PMs. Been out, 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 home, out, home, out, home, out, here, there and everywhere today. Just put some food in the oven, got lasagna from Costco. So we're gonna have that. Right now, I'm just gonna chill out for a little bit, catch up on some work, wait for that to be done, and then just relax. It's been a go, go, go day. I'm using my phone as a torch right now. It's 2 a.m. in the morning. Time to go to bed. Hello everybody, it is Saturday afternoon right now. Uh, I've done nothing today. I kind of got up and just been on my computer, did a bit of work, but also just chilling out. Um, sorted out the JV, so the P&L was a couple of days behind on it because, uh, because it's the first month we need to figure out everything that's gone out and who's always what and this that the rest. So we sorted that out, but I paid off the uh, JV partner for this month. So that's fantastic. Um, he has received £900, 400 of that is um, what we owe. So he, he paid, basically paid like £900 and something pounds more than what we put in at the start just because he's buying furniture and stuff so we half that so I sent him that then I also sent him the profit for January 50% of the profit which was again about 400 and 
68 quid or something like that off the top of my head. So, you know, both of us making nearly 500 pounds um, in January, the first month it's gone live is absolutely fantastic. So it's looking good for the month going forward. And this is why we JV with people. We like to work with the right people. We've got to be with the right people and you've got to have the right training. So we will really only JV with our mentees. We know they've got the training. We know they've got the support because we're here doing it with them. So it's perfect. Can I get some food right now? And the giant's point later. That is it for Saturday. Unfortunately, the Giants did not get the win. They came up short. They didn't play too good throughout the game, but in the last quarter, they really started to bring it back, and it was only a 10-point game in the end, so don't die, Joe. Yeah, they pulled it back, which is good. Right now, I'm going to go to bed. Thank you all so much for watching the vlog. It is Sunday today. I'm about to start editing it, so I can upload it for tomorrow. I really appreciate you all watching it. If you have any questions about our training and mentoring, please do let me know. I've got an amazing challenge coming up in March, which I will tell you more and more about as the weeks go on. But if you're interested in getting involved in the challenge, reach out to me on Instagram. I'm more than happy to get you involved. It's going to be amazing, and the winner is going to win £1,000 from me. So get involved, send me a message, and let's do it. Thanks so much for watching. Comment, subscribe, like, all that good stuff. See you next week. Peace.